this is one of those rare gems in Los Angeles. A little more volume, please. It's Start again. This, I'm using my indoor voice because I don't want your Germans to come and kill me. That'd be awesome on camera. Go. Right. Okay. Well. Welcome to LA Gold. This is Jason Bailey and this is co-contributor commander Cody Murray. Cody, welcome. Happy to be here. Excellent. As always. We decided we'd get the hell out of the studio today and talk about stuff that actually mattered here in wonderful Los Angeles. We've been here 15 years. Oh we thought God. it'd be we thought it'd be great to bring some of our knowledge to you if you visit this great, great city. <laughs> Absolutely. Look, stay away from all the tourist traps. Don't go to the University of City. Don't go to the studios. They're just trying to steal your money, and it's really not that exciting. Come right. here. But not when we're here. Okay. This Thanks. is the Red Lion Beer Tavern here in downtown Silver Lake. It's been here. Yeah, it's oh, Silver Lake. Silver, Silver Lake, Los Angeles. And we've been coming here for probably close to the same amount of time we've been 12 here. 12 years plus. Long time. Anyway, it's great. It is as German as it gets. The service is German. Don't expect much. The food is German. It tastes pretty good. And the beer is goddamn German. It's great. I actually brought a German here a few months ago. A guy we met at yes. uh, Burning Man. And he was touring the States, touring the world uh, after his Burning Man experience. And he came here and he's like, wow, it's like a little slice of home. It's so nice. Yeah. Hey, so, a German gives it a thumbs up. Bam. You know it's good. It's got anyway, good. meet us inside and we'll show you some good stuff here on LA Gold, the beer tavern Red Lion. I've been sitting here at the Red Lion beer garden that Cody and I find most, most wonderful. What is it about this place that we love, Cody? I found this place a hundred years ago, not the ages, but look at this beautiful outdoor patio. These fantastic icy cold German beers. Again, when we ate meat, there was this spectacular sausage platter. Now, the, the trick about the Red Lion, you don't want to come here on amateur days or nights. Has There's it turned sort of hipster on us? Yeah, we've kind of lost it to the dark side, at least a little bit. Uh, especially, again, Thursday night, Friday night, Saturday night. Just don't, don't come unless you're one of those people. But on an afternoon, such as today, where it's, I don't know, 75 in the dead of winter, gross. So here we have it outside the beer garden. It's absolutely gorgeous and beautiful. And you can smoke out here too if you're into the cigar situation. You know, another but can thing. you make the shot when it really matters? Here we go. And there's my beautiful wife. Hi. And, and here's my beautiful sister. Put the camera back on me. Come on, let's go. And there's my beautiful friend. Thank you. Uh, back in the day, they used to have TVs up here. They would do sporting events. It was a big hangout for Dodgers fans. And that's too bad because I hate sports. So oh, this I is know. better. It's actually better this way because it weeds out some of that a-hole crowd. It's nice. All right. So at the Red Lion here, it's been open since 1959. Um, they have a selection of items that are fantastic. Now, both Commander Cody and I are vegetarian now, um, you know, which is definitely the way to go. However, we understand many of you are not. So when we came here and we were carnivores and absolute dinosaurs, we used to have what was known as the sausage platter. We highly, highly recommend the sausage platter. It's basically got every single kind of bratwurst, sausage, hot dog situation you could ever want all tied up in little tiny bite-sized pieces. And by the time you're done with it, your belly is out the frickin' hair, okay? It's absolutely fantastic to go along with your fine German beer. Uh, show them a little of the leftovers we have here, sir. We uh, took care of a lot. Well, I'd like to show you the food, but it's all fucking gone. You can also smoke cigars out here. Uh, it's something that's uh, completely gone in today's society. And you can even bring your four-legged companion. So if you have a dog, check out the Red Lion. You want some good beer, check out the Red Lion. You want a cigar, which I should be having right now, check out the Red Lion. But anyway, just some more food items. There are potato pancakes. Fucking great. Get the potato pancakes. Get the uh, sausage platter, you can't go wrong. Okay, we're gonna take you on a little bit of a tour here of the Red Lion. We're going in from the beer garden down into the second level bar. There's actually three bars at the Red Lion. I think we've been kicked out of every single one of them at this point. This inside has got a little cave-like atmosphere. It's a little more kitschy. It's got a little more uh, German-ness to the whole thing. But it's a fantastic bar, and a lot of times you're going to get better service on this second floor. 
We're coming through here now, and uh, we're looking at the old, look at that old cigarette machine from the 70s. Oh my god, love it. Uh, you're seeing a whole grip of beer steins, and beer stein collections. Fantastic. Um, we're going downstairs now into what would be the opening of the restaurant. Um, once we get down there, great beer steins, great beer steins. Uh, once you go down there, that is actually the front entrance. Uh, a lot of times they'll have uh, an organ player, a little piano player, keyboard player down there playing some great, mu you know, German style music for you or just some 70s shit. But at any rate, it's pretty fantastic. You look around there, uh, but that is your opening bar. It's probably where it really started from. It's, a, it's got probably the fullest of all the bars. Uh, ask Cody about the coaster incident from, you know, whatever the hell that was. I'm surprised they let us in here at all, for God's sakes. We're going back up the stairs now, and here we're going back into the second floor. Just in case you forgot what this was, it is the Red Lion. Thanks for that, Cody. And now we're going back. These are the restrooms. A lot of old-world beer, turn-of-the-century posters and artwork, fantastic stuff. We're going back out into the beer garden now. Uh, where, uh, once again, that's where most of the recording has been. Most of the episodes taking place here, you get to smoke your cigars. You can get to uh, Berlin, Germany there. It's only 6,000 miles away, and uh, we're back. But uh, I want to give you a nice virtual tour of what the entire place looks like. As you can see, it's amazing. Perfect. Wonderful. We're playing Queen inside. The show must go on. Are you fucking kidding me? The greatest beer pub in L.A. My friend. My friend. World's finest. Cheers. Cheers. To Magneto. It's out of focus, kid.